Hi, this is Sherry. Welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm going to be preparing a, a favorite of our families, um, a spinach and strawberry salad. And I bring this a lot of times to family picnics. It's a great, it's always a hit with kids because it's pretty simple. I have baby spinach. Just get the bag of baby spinach. It's pretty simple. You can, if you um, prefer to, you know, get baby spinach as, um, you know, get it from the farmer's market, that's fine too. But I usually buy the bag baby spinach and throw it into a bowl. That's done. And then I cut up some strawberries. Most kids love strawberries. So when they see strawberries on the salad, they're like, oh, I'm going to like that salad. And today, um, <clears throat> the strawberries I cut into slices. So all I do is cut off the top and I slice it kind of like you slice a tomato. And it's pretty simple. And really, that's pretty much it. Slice the strawberries. I throw them on top of my salad. So it's pretty simple. They look beautiful with the green and the red strawberry. And last but not least, I don't want to make this too simple, but there's only one more ingredient, and it's red onion. And you would think, onion and strawberries, but really, it tastes amazing. Um, and you know what? I do the, the, the onion in rings, uh, so that way people can pick it out if they don't like onion. But it really does add such a nice flavor to it. And um, a lot of times what I'll do is I won't put the onion on the salad until I get to the party. And that is so that it, because it is a strong flavor and I like to save it for right before I serve it. Okay, so if it doesn't get similar, that's pretty much the whole salad. And again, always a great hit. I remember one party I brought it to, I had one girl, um, young girl, I, I think she was about 14, loved the salad so much. There was like a little bit left at the end and we poured it into a bag and she took it home with her because she loved it so much. Um, so what do we put on it? We have a great dressing. Now I'm gonna warn you, you're gonna, you're gonna be surprised, but I do use mayo in this. This is a poppy seed dressing. It's a sweet dressing, a sweet creamy dressing. And you're like, well, mayo, that's maybe not so healthy, but you know what? You can make your own mayo. You can make mayo pretty healthy if you wanted to by making it yourself. I'm gonna tell you a secret. It's not homemade today, but it's, it's something to bring to a party. So it's not like food that you're eating every single day. And the amount that you're gonna get on the salad is very small, so it's really not too bad. Um, on, with the mayo, I'm gonna add about a quarter cup of milk. I'm using unsweetened almond milk. You can pretty much use whatever milk. The original recipe calls for whole milk, and that's fine too. So whatever kind of milk you have is good. And another thing that you're not gonna believe, but I do add sugar to this. And this is really a sweet poppy seed dressing, so you do need to add some sweetener. If you would prefer, you could do a honey or a maple syrup. Um, I'm trying to keep the taste very neutral, so I'm just using plain old, um, an organic, um, unprocessed sugar. Uh, white vinegar. And last but not least, the magic ingredient is poppy seeds. That's pretty much it. I want to make this more complex for you, but that's really all there is to it. Shake it up. There you go. Your dressing is ready. And what I'll do is I will pour the dressing on, usually right before uh, I serve it. The reason being is it does kind of saturate the salad, and it's... You can eat it the next day, but it is pretty soggy, although I like the taste of it the next day. It is very, really, really um, flavorful. So I wanna thank you for joining me today. I hope uh, you will try making a strawberry salad and you'll see that your family and people at a picnic will love it. It's, um, I'm always uh, asked to bring it along whenever I come to a picnic because everybody always loves it. And a really simple dressing that you can use for this salad or, or any other salad. So thanks for joining me today. Please share this video with another mom if you thought it was helpful. 
I'd really appreciate comment below and I look forward to talking to you again real soon. If you would like to learn more about us, uh, head on over to our Facebook page at Sherry and Chris or our Instagram at Sherry and Chris. And um, we're also on YouTube, Pinterest, and Twitter. And again, thanks for joining me today.